three, two, one, go. Hey, now we're both in. Both there. We're in. Yeah, we're okay. over here. We're gonna end and we set. Hey, <laughs> hello. You hey, did you uh, did you trim up your beard? No. No, not at all. I just let it run wild, I'm man. Sure it it's getting a little bit long. It's not. <laughs> Howdy, y'all. I'm Mr. Hello. Holga, and I'm Todd Puckett, and this is Don's used photo, and mm -hmm. we're equipment. Glad. Photo equipment, yes. Yeah. No. I, I keep it. That's okay. So uh, today we're going to do a little show and tell a couple of things we've got. Uh, yes. And uh, I've received some new cool new stuff. You've received some cool new stuff. And we'll start with you. Absolutely. So what I received in the mail was this beautiful, beautiful Ondu camera. This is an Ondu pinhole camera. Ondu? It's an all wood camera. Yeah. I have not opened it. Anyways, uh, so I'm going to <laughs> unbox it for you guys here right now today. I know unboxing videos are very exciting. First, we have this lovely paper. You can't get that just anywhere. You know, Special there, there are people who have uh, sensory overloads to oh, certain yeah. sounds. Sorry. So, Sorry, don't, don't run. Oh, okay. run, hide. Exactly. Attack of the paper. Uh, we have a very lovely, I'm going to assume strap. Yep. Okay, very nice strap. We so have, they spared no expenses on this, man. We have a very lovely uh, key fob with some uh, pinhole times on it. Very nice. I'm going to hold it the right way. See? Oh, good. So, good. It, so it can help you with that. That's the exposure value scale. Exactly. Uh, reach into the bottom here. So we have a coupon for 10 rolls of film from Don's used photo. We have a certificate of authenticity for your coupon for 10 used rolls of, rolls of film from Don's used photo. Actually, yeah. it's not. I, mean, I know. It's right. just junk that's in the bottom here. Wow. See, I don't know what goes on, so it could be. Yeah. Exactly. Uh, here is the lovely little camera. Oh, wait, wait, wait. You got more stuff in here. Look at this. Stickers. <laughs> stickers. Dude, stickers are fun. All right. Yeah, stickers. Sorry. Stickers. They're stickers. Yeah. All right, I'm going to put the box away. So now we have the lovely little uh, baggie of camera right now. Yes. Now I understand the uh, the cam the bags actually are made by the uh, designer's mom. Oh, that's very nice. I mean, she does a nice job. Now this is my second Ondu camera. This is the, the, this is actually the third version of the Ondu cameras. Uh, I unfortunately did not get one of the first versions. Uh, I understand they were, they were good. The second version I definitely got on board. There was a Kickstarter campaign. Uh, it was a really I got actually a six by seventeen camera. It was really nice. A little hard to use. Uh, the, the company was so great that they actually, um, they said, yeah, there were problems with that camera. So they sent me a six by 12 camera for free, which I thought was fantastic, fantastic. And I've taken many great pictures of that one. I mm -hmm. love that camera. So this You're time I have a few pictures of our store. Right? I have, I've taken yeah. shots in here with that camera. So now this is a six by six. Now you're going to have to post them whenever we do this. Exactly. Yeah. This is a six by six camera. And so this is my tiny little Whoa. six by six camera. So. This nice little bag, Ondu. Ondu. Exactly. So this lovely is mostly wood. The knobs are uh, metal, and this is a removable uh, filter holder right here. So I can get this filter and wow. uh, this lovely little red 58 millimeter filter. Just that is magnetic, right huh? And magnetic, exactly. So wow. So uh, in times before, you'd either have to tape a filter on. But which is really hard when you've got a, a, an arm that kind of goes back and forth. They, they have they have solved that problem. I'm gonna, yes. I'll just remove yeah. the filter here. So what you see is I have a nice little pin hole for the hole. And instead of having the armature, which comes up and out of the way, which the filter would be a problem, right. it just has a little slide. peek a -boo. So it just has a little slide, which will show the, the pin hole. Yes. Which and is I mean, very it's nice. It's an itty bitty pin hole. It's tiny. They, I believe these are laser drilled pin holes. Wow. That's it's very just nice. like a micro dot. It is. And in the back, they've done essentially the same thing all over again. So that for the protective red window, you have a slide as well so that you can see your fill. Yeah, yeah. So this is have, fun. This is a nice little camera. And so whenever you put it on there, it goes right back into place. I mean, Exactly. That, well, it, it all magnetic just snaps right on there. Yeah, right. Um, this model also has little eyelets for uh, the camera strap. Right. But I'm probably going to make my own strap. You know me. And so... And is that magnetic too? It, it's all magnetic. So and check, 120. So it's magnets all around. That's what's holding the back on there. Now, don't think that these are cheap magnets here because they really hold very well. Can you hold that? Sure. Fantastic. So what you do is you take a box of roll of film like this mm -hmm. and you open it up. Yeah. And he's going to sit there and 
and then you, then you then you open it all the way up, and then as if film yeah. wasn't hard enough, you have to open it one more time. And that is actually like masking tape. Oh, crap. That's and then, like... and then you put on your glasses so you can see the dark gun thing. It is masking tape. Yeah, I know. They spared no expense. Mm -mm. It's a Jurassic you should go. Park. Oh, you should go the other direction. There we go. No, I mean, I get the pen. I mean, all right. There we go. All right. So now, so this is just a little holder right here. It's going to hold it in place. The nice part about that, that Whoa. just comes off. So you notice there's two more maggots there. Yes. So that goes in here. That goes in the top. There wow. you go. You're in place. <laughs> This is actually kind of fun. I'm going to pull the leader on over. There you go. You want me to hold this for you while you do that? I'll hold this. Okay. okay. So I pulled the, the paper across in the top. I put it in the first slot on this side. We're going to start winding. And now the paper will start and now going. You're upside down. But that's okay. Well, we're upside down, anyways, in there. Start. Actually, you should be able to go to the, uh, the first line, right? Yeah. Well, if, no, they may not have to line for this. So well, they normally do. There oh, we go. Yeah, that's there you go. Okay. All right. So line it up there. That's where you really should stop loading the film. Yes. You are done at that point because after that, you're going to start exposing the film. So this is six by six. So the numbers should line up with this hole right here. Right. Which I'm going to let me make sure which way is open because now I can't see it. All right, that is open. That's open. Okay. All right, so now I'm going to advance it to where I can see the number in here. Can you see? Because I, I see nothing. Well, there you go. Can you see that? No. You want to see little white arrows that's in there? That's all right. No, I see nothing. Go ahead. No, no, you no. Can, no. See can you see little arrows in there? Barely. Yeah, now. that's, that's oh. all you need to see. And we just put new lights in, too. But, uh, yes, I was about to ask you. It's like, uh, it's so bright in here. How bright is that? Okay. And there's one, there's a dot, there's a smaller dot, tinier dots, the dots get even smaller. And then there's the number one. Number you can one? see the number one, right? Sure. All right. Yeah. So at this particular point, this ready. camera is ready to oh, take do you photos. Need to... Well, I can, oh, yes. Yeah, thank okay. you. It doesn't matter. So it's all closed up, it's all ready to go. Yes. I'm ready to take some photos. All right. And so I guess it's I'll show you simple. guys when the when these photos come out. I'm not yes. going to take any while we're doing this right now. No, no, no. Now, the fun part is, is what he loaded it with? Cat Labs Film. I did, yes. This company only came into existence in May of this year. June, July, August. Only three months old. And I've also changed things up, which is why we moved over a little bit. We've added a new shelf yep. rack here. And got um, all the film that I had hidden. But we had the slide film for for, uh, for Fuji, Cat Labs film, double film, and my newest and latest and greatest. The newest. Jade Lang speed plates. 10 4x5 dry mount glass plates. Which At, is super cool. Yes, and it's 25 ASA. I like that he says ASA instead of ISO. <laughs> 25 that is nice. ASA. That's 10 glass plates in there that are pre-coated with a dry emulsion as opposed to the wet plates like Tintype. Exactly, which, you know, the ether and all that kind of stuff. There's no, so there's no time limit on these. Not really. Yeah. There shouldn't be. No. And uh, we also have this in 8x10. Wow. So, five hand-coated 8x10 silver plate, silver gelatin plates. Again, J Lang speed plates. Now they have these in uh, ASA 2 and ASA 25. What I have up here left are, of course, the ASA 25. Now, whenever I talked with Jason, or typed back and forth, he said, <laughs> Get the 25 speed twos for really specialty stuff. Mm, the yeah. first two that I sold, ASA 2. So we have a lot of really uh, experienced photographers I hope here so, yeah. who love the fun stuff like two and therefore that's the first two ones that I sold were the ASA 2 and the 4x5 and for 40 bucks 4 bucks a glass plate that's pretty cool that is, that's that is pretty cool. cool so what about developing on these I mean are they are they going to take any special chemicals other than what you're are currently carrying no special chemicals so the chemicals are the same but from what I understand 
that's the water temperature that's a really big issue. So um, you can actually sort of overwash it or something and take the emulsion layer off of it. So you have to read the instructions on how to develop this okay. so that you just don't remove the layer of everything and um, then just have a nice clean glass plate. And it, he's, he says he's done that while he was doing trial and error on this stuff. So got that going. Now with this new rack in, as I said, I've got the Fuji slide, I got the Cat Labs and the 35, 120, and 8x10. And I've sold all my 4 by 5 Got the double film. This this is my uh, plate down stuff for my, my sacks. And the very bottom, I've got all of the film that's uh, my stock that's... Overflow. Uh, overflow. It, it, it's overflow. There's overflow. A, I mean, because I'm actually, if you look to the other side of me, I mean, the Everything, the Ilford is all super stocked. I see washi film down there is film all stocked. Film washi's back in stock. The A, D, F, S, and Z are in. The yeah. B and the W will be in next month. But I got like 50 and 40 rolls of, of a lot of those things and maybe 25 of one of them. And of course, that's the one I sold a bunch of right off the yeah. bat. You know, it's the one I had the least about. It's funny, <laughs> whatever was popular the first two go arounds, um, Everybody's already played with, so now yeah. they're going after the other ones. And um, really, the A and the S w have been flying off the shelf, which were the slower ones last time. And so I've got that stocked in. But I've got the Portra 400, 120 here. I've got 210, 20, 20 rolls out, but I've got 100 rolls down here, just sitting here waiting to fill in the spot. So I've got 300 rolls of that. And got a new good supplier on these things. So I should not have the problems I've had with Kodak in the past. And that's good news. But yes, now I've got far more of my film up and on display. Oh, yeah. It's fantastic. A lot of stuff behind me here, guys. Yeah. So uh, we do have one more thing we'd like to show. You have a very pretty little camera. Just got it in today. Just got it in. As a matter of fact, I think you said you had two of them. But still, it sh oh, oh, excuse me. He only has one of them. But yeah. still, this is a very lovely uh, crown graphic, is it? Speed graphic. Speed graphic. Speed this graphic. is a very clean 4x5 camera. 4x5, and I really just got it and haven't played with it very much. And uh, But it's very clean. And The bellows uh, look great. Uh, oh, I even yeah. uh, clicked the shutter a couple times myself. Well, I was gone. Well, yeah, but you know, you handed it to me. That's true. Expect, so true. it was your own fault. <laughs> <laughs> yes, and so anyway, I will have fun playing with this. And I believe that this is a Graflux back so should be able to put all of the other things on there like the um the, the 120 film 120 and, film back yeah. holders things like that on the back of this but anyway just got this in uh this morning and have checked the let's do this because this is always the fun part it is it's on a, one second uh whenever you're doing things like this and you're testing them the one second is always the easiest hear that and it's a nice study and it just cuts off stop a lot of times you click that and you hear or but anyway this is a good solid all the way across yeah, yeah. if it sounds like yeah that's oh, a bad yeah. thing nice. <laughs> okay. if it kind of fizzes out there towards <laughs> the end or the other benefit of doing this here is i cleared out all the junk that was on the floor and put it back behind the uh, shelves so much oh, yeah. more foot space in here and finally Oh, brighter. Somebody actually turned the lights on in here. I don't yes. it's uh, it's really super bright in here actually. I I would say he's replaced well over 20 bulbs in here. No, no, 50. <laughs> there each each thing has four bulbs. 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10. So, yeah. So if know. this video is of a higher quality or you can see more of the wrinkles in our faces, it's the lights. It's the lights. It's We're weird, blaming weird. the lights and they're all more or less unified. Um Instead of orange blue, <laughs> yeah, we're, we're not even. Uh, the first couple of videos actually, we were doing this with a little supplemental light, but now it's like, don't I even mean, bother. This yeah, is like way we, we, is, we are well lit. for you guys. This is too much light for us. Mm -hmm. uh, well, so I think that was about it. So uh, once again, we'd like for you guys to uh, subscribe, uh, subscribe, to subscribe, like, please add some comments, share, share, share please tell always. a friend. 
uh, come into the store. Todd gives out autographs, or I actually, do. he takes your autographs, I like do. credit card receipts, right? Yes. You take autographs? Yes, I do, I do. And he, that's what I he say. loves. Those are his favorite autographs. Whenever people give me a credit card, which I do give back, they swipe it, and I run it, and, he, and I ask for their autograph. I said, exactly, every time. Business. Todd would love to have your autograph, so yes. please come into the store. So like, save, share, tell for, uh, friends about it, and mm -hmm. uh, we'll see you guys next time, right? Yes. Ciao, baby. There you go. All right. Now, grew up in <laughs> I was going to buy some film for so. uh, <laughs>